What's up, everybody? How's it going? Give y'all some time to come on in. What's up, Noah? Yeah, come on in. Roll on Come on in, and we gonna talk. Got a special lecture for y'all today. What's up, Rashida? What's up, Miss Mimi? She the more you need some good advice today. I understand that. But let's see, can I cheer y'all up a little bit? Give y'all another minute and we'll be ready to go.
Give me a mini con. Let me get the information out. We'll talk. All right, let's do this. All right, today's lecture is one of my bigger ones. I tie this in the Baphomet, Masters, and how it relates to the Shepherd in the Bible. Now, the first question I guess we're going to ask is, who is the Baphomet? And I'm going to explain that the Baphomet is the physical personification of the Creator. Especially during the times of night, the other night Templars. And he was always seen with a with a goddess by the name of Lady Sophia, also known as Isis, who um will represent the fem feminine counterpart, which is the creatrice. See what I'm saying? And these two these two in it these two entities alone uh would would guide those those yeah, uh, those spiritual beings of the time. You see what I'm saying? You know, and to this day, they still, uh, since the Baphomet is still the ongoing represent, uh, Baphomet, Lady Isis or Sophia, are still the ongoing energy, uh, energies that represent the creator and creatures at this time. They, uh, they, they still build the statues of the Baphomet to this day. You know, still, still using this energy, even though I'll be it perverted using his name in vain you know <sighs> that's what we dealing with 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 these beings with these cabal agents or whatever but you know you know that ain't got nothing to do with those them motherfuckers crazy we already know that they they lost it a long time ago and they pretty much lost control of this matrix because we are uh have ascended pretty much to the fifth dimension and y'all start seeing results of that throughout all of uh, next year and the rest of this year. So now let's see. When I said Baphomet Masters, you know we talking about the 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 Rashid Moore. That's why I thought I was I thought I was a bad thing. Nah, she she uh them them the dead the motherfuckers on the planet. Uh, them the disease on the planet, the cabal, the Illuminati, and the shit that they've been doing for the last 2,000 to 6,000 years, you know, so, 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 they, they, they the ones been fucking this shit up, and we've been uh, suffering because of them, but now their time is up, they rule is up, the planet won't change, we won't change, so, 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 now, <sighs> the creator has heard that order, and there's been um set in motion a series of events to resolve this issue. See what I'm saying? So next we got uh, um a little bit more about the creator and you know the boss made and later ISIS. You know the creator is pretty much that omniversal guiding intelligence that fuels our creation by gathering intel and intelligence and expanding upon itself you see what i'm saying intel or information expanding upon this your your subconscious mind is an archive center and whenever you pass on or move on that archive center get uploaded to the consciousness of the creator see what i'm saying and of course creatrice is the source melanin um that dark jazzy intelligence you know, funky, soulful intelligence that empowers everything. You see what I'm saying? And everyone in the universe. So, those are, that's what the Baphomet and Lady Isis represent, the creators. Now, the next thing I'm going to get to is, who are the Baphomet masters? Now, I did a video not too long ago called Knights of Baphomet. Yeah, 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 and that's 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 been an ongoing series so far. Um, uh, that's been an ongoing series in the sense that you got 
a couple of videos that I've done, like the fall of Ancient America, that was more the prequel to the Knights of Baphomet. Then I've done uh, one for the Primordial Realm, that was the sequel to Baphomet. And then to Knights of Baphomet. And finally, I did Creator and Creatures, and that was, that was part three to the Knights of Baphomet series. This will be part four. So, so, so. So, so, yeah, so, 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 I've been building up on this series for some time now. Now, the Baphomet Masters. Oh, yes. Now, now the Baphomet Masters, you know, we talking about them Jedi Masters now. Uh, uh, what, 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 what do we mean by Baphomet Masters? What we mean by them, by that is, these beings have taken up the cause or the torch, and they begin... <laughs> They begin their journey uh, of the hero, and they, tra they they travel so far in it that they learn so much that they literally represent the symbol of that particular energy that they're dealing with. So, 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 say for example, we're going to look at Mace Windu and Yoda. We know for a fact that they master Jedi's. You see what I'm saying? It just oozes off them. It's their presence. It's in their aura. It's in their energy. We know that they they've been doing it wholeheartedly. They loved it. That, that was their path in their in that um in their life. And they enjoy every moment of it. And if you walk up to them, whether they had on Jedi attire or regular clothes, you know. Nah. This person is a Jedi here. You see what I'm saying? That's what we talking about when we say Baphomet Masters. Jedi Masters. You see what I'm saying? Magi Masters. What's up, Jillian? You see what I'm saying? They 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 have this force. They have this power about them. And the only thing that separates the master from apprentice is is they have went on this journey and learned what they need to learn, whereas the apprentice is still trying to figure it out. You see what I'm saying? They still trying to work their way through, um, trying to figure out this energy inside of them and what's, uh, how they're going to use it uh, in the world around them. You see what I'm saying? So, so this is what we're talking about when we say uh, Master Yoda, uh, Mace Windu, the, Mag the Magi Masters of old, the Jedi Masters of old, the, 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 Knight Templar Grand Wizards, the Master Hoodoo Conjurers, and Medicine Men and Women, the 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 um the yogis of the time, the 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 the, the ancient Taoists who walked the earth. This is what we mean by them 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 Baphomet masters, though those beings who came here to elevate the consciousness of the planet. And how this relates to the shepherd in the Bible or uh is uh, well, let me tell you what shepherd means, actually. Shepherd in the Bible just means guide, pathfinder, way sure, you know. That old wise man or woman sitting on the mountain, pointing the way, uh, helping you find your path. And each one of us has a shepherd inside of us. We know it as our higher self. And our higher self guides us to where we need to go intuitively, even logically. And I don't want y'all to think that uh, you're not using... Uh, you're not using your logic from time to time to solve problems. You see what I'm saying? But now you use your intuition to to bring to 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 follow that path, to go through that journey of the hero, that journey of the magi warrior, that journey of the mystical being. You see what I'm saying? We all here to do that. We these days we're nothing but magical war dogs down here overseeing what's going on on the planet. Making sure that this planet ascends to its highest heights. You know, why we got to stop at the fifth dimension. You see what I'm saying? Why we can't go to the sixth or the seventh or the eighth. You see what I'm saying? We are the only ones stopping us from getting to where we need to be. And it's up to us to make sure that we get to where we need to be. You see what I'm saying? You got you got help. You got, you got God, spirit God, soul God, soul guardians. You know, ET fam, extended ET family, shoot ancestors, everybody back to help you. That's why so y'all probably have noticed all the soul energy on the planet now, all the soul force, uh, flow emanating through the planet. It that soul energy exploded 
around the period of Black Panther. You see what I'm saying? That's what it was all about. It was all about the energy. It was all about the 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 soul. Your soul awoken during that period. That immortal spark. You see what I'm saying? Exploded on the planet in a mass in a in a mass amount. So now what happened in the '60s and '70s has 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 been brought back up. Now it's being checked and balanced, so we can move forward. You see what I'm saying? Those soul brothers, soul sisters, and everybody who who played their roles during that time period, we resolving that energy now. And then by next year, you're gonna see a whole new type of soul that you've never seen before. A whole new um soulful presence or soulful energy on the planet we just we just working through old soul now you know what we call old souls back in the day we working through that old soul energy where we we just picking up what we left off in the 60s and 70s and, and picking it back up yeah 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 what's up siobhan the volunteers exactly rashida more the racism yeah we're working through all that the racism everything you see what i'm saying so 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 this is what we talk. This is what we talking about. When we said, uh, what's what's going on?" So, 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 the next thing is gonna happen is, um, we're going to get more more powerful in soul. You see what I'm saying? We're going to get more stronger in soul. So, 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 be looking out for that. Be looking out for these upgrades, these changes, this growth. You see what I'm saying? So, 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 you better believe that. Next, what's going to happen is, hold on, hold on, y'all. What's up? Give me a second, y'all. But, yeah. Yeah, next what you're gonna see happening is you're gonna see a mass transition on the planet. You see what I'm saying? You're gonna you're gonna see an explosiveness happen on the planet with this soul energy. Alright, had to make had to change positions here. You know how that is. So 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. That that this mass soul energy on the planet and it's getting stronger and stronger. You'll see things get you probably can even see it in the air right now. That gold energy, that gold light flowing through the world. You know, gold gold light is soul light. You know, it's it's energy that uh this energy is spun directly from the source, the realm of the source, the realm of the creator. So we all can tap into that. So yeah, yeah. We what what y'all been seeing lately is we've been in a dark cycle. I mean, a very dark cycle. Um, we we we've been in uh, a cycle of degeneration and destruction, cause Earth is purging, purifying herself, and so this is what the this is why the Baphomet masters, the psychic warriors and warriors is the 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 healers, the 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 twin flames, the star seeds. The, the Jedi's, you know, the list goes on, necromancers, you know, and uh, all are back to heal the planet. You see what I'm saying? And they making sure everybody playing their role, doing their role to make sure everybody is successful. You see what I'm saying? So, 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 so. The next thing I want to tell you what's going on with this shepherd energy. The shepherd, the shepherd is this person who guides you you know like Yoda did for Luke Skywalker he guided like Luke Skywalker and it wasn't just Yoda in and of himself it was his teachings that he was transmitting to Luke Skywalker that, that made the the Empire Strike back so powerful Luke, Luke, Luke didn't believe in himself he didn't believe you had he had this this supernatural force inside of him this 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 internal force or power uh, living inside of him, he 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 didn't believe he can move um, his uh, star fighter. He didn't he didn't he didn't believe he can levitate it. And Yoda was like, "Nah, you you got it. You, you just gotta go within and tap into it and bring it out of you. That that's what you gotta do." 
if 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 uh how you gonna be the master if you don't find the master within you see what i'm saying you already a master but you got to bring that inner that inner deity that inner soul warrior up out of you you see what i'm saying so so luke tried to levitate it. he failed and he thought uh uh, he failed because he didn't believe he could do it in the first place. And that's why Yoda told him, you failed. After he showed him it was possible. You didn't have faith in yourself. How you, how you going to say the world or the galaxy, you ain't got faith in yourself. You see what I'm saying? You ain't, you ain't, you ain't strong in your, uh, you, ain't, you ain't centered in your own personal um, uh, spiritual force. You see what I'm saying? Soulful force. You see what I'm saying? So, so, so this is what we dealing with. This, this is, this is the, um, uh, this, this is what the shepherd does. He reminds you, or she reminds you, who you are and what you about. You know, you know, <clears throat> you, 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 you have a destiny, Luke Skywalker. You, you destined to balance the force. You destined to bring balance to the galaxy, and you can only do that when you tap into the force inside you. Because whatever you do inside you reflects outside you. See what I'm saying? So that's what it's all about. Next, what I want to talk about is, uh, yes, Noda, uh, Yoda transmitted these teachings to him. And this, this process of transmitting your knowledge, wisdom, and power to your apprentice is called boom giving. So, so Yoda was the boom giver. See what I'm saying? He was the chosen one who, who was um he, who was tasked with making sure Luke had the necessary knowledge, wisdom, and power to fight the darkness or the toxicity planet, you know, because you know, not all darkness is bad. Some darkness is great. That's what Luke found out in the cave. He, he realized like, nah, Darth Vader was me. You know, that was my inner shadow that I had to master. Now the real toxicity he hadn't even came across yet. That was what was represented in the 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 emperor. You know, you know, we know it as the Pope in our world, but it's being even higher than the Pope. So 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 he had to fight this. He had to he had to fight this this mystical war, this holy war. That's what it really was, a holy war to slay the galaxy because everybody was in tears, slavery, misery, pain, suffering, all throughout the cosmos. Thanks to this one particular being uh, using his, his using his wizardry for dark purposes, you see what I'm saying? So that, that's 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 what uh, Luke's mission was. So 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 that's what that's why Yoda had to uh, make sure he transmitted these this wisdom and this power to Luke, so he would uh, had a strength to and 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 uh and the uh, and the knowledge to defeat this 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 dark being you see what i'm saying this toxic being so 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 next let's talk about how you become a jedi master you know i hadn't even talked about that now everybody knows that um uh, every well i like to say chosen one goes through this process this this is like a prerequisite period where they are primed to awaken you see what i'm saying and when they awaken they unleash this toxic chaos inside of them they unleash all the bullshit uh all the lies that they was uh taught you know and it pisses them off they're angry they're going through all these emotions and and Happening is since they went through all these emotions, they they transforming. You see what I'm saying? They 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 getting up out of there. Uh, they 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 getting up out of this 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 dark state or this unconscious state, which we know as the sheep state. You see what I'm saying? The 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 sleeping god state, the zombie state. They 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 they, they coming up out of there. They found the cure for the uh, zombification. You see what I'm saying? They found. They found um, a way to awaken the God within. So that's what this awakening process is about. And I give you a perfect example. Before you awaken, awoken, you ever noticed that the sun burns you? See what I'm saying? The sun burns your skin because your melanin was toxic. But after you awoken and went through the refinement, the 
internal process and healing. Yo, uh, you go out to the sun that outside and in it's in the sun now. Melanin don't uh, the sun don't burn you no more. Uh, it vibrates your melanin now and recharges it, supercharges it. You see what I'm saying? So, so, so that's a that's an indication that you went through that awakening process. See what I'm saying? See this this is what we talking about. When the, this this is the journey of the hero who who is who is on the path to become a master um in the a master in the force in the source you know had to to acquire that master stance that symbol that representation that archetypal energy that would uh show everyone around him or her that we have the gift you see what i'm saying we 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 the new chosen ones on the block the new heirs to the force you see what i'm saying this, this is this is what we talking about so so you go through this process you learn you grow you get stronger uh until you become centered in yourself and you, you go there you fight off uh you, you clean out your subconscious mind you, you get rid of the, the the darkness within you you clean out your your inner dungeons deal with all the entities inside of you clean them out you know and, and purify everything transmute everything into into power you see what i'm saying that that you gonna use to or that you later on gonna use to awaken and heal others that that's what you notice about all the masters the boss of their masters after a while uh the the force inside them uh matures not only just awakens in the roots but it matures to a point where their force explode out of them into the environment and they can literally affect the reality around them we call this area of effect you know it's a video game term you got area of effect ability as well uh just being in uh just that um your powers affect the environment around you and awaken souls you see what i'm saying and it's a fair this area of effect can become big as a state it can become big as a planet you know you know this yo yo your energy field is limitless you don't you don't have to be just uh uh limited to one neighborhood or one city or anything like that. No, your your energy field can extend far far past this realm. You see what I'm saying? Back all the way back to the creator or the source, as we said. See what I'm saying? This this is the power that we are talking about. This is what this is this is this is what we mean when we say on the path to becoming that Jedi Master, that energetic symbol, that magical sigil or archetype that um, that uh, every that that represents that particular energy they're dealing with. That that's that's what all the deities are about. They just represent the archetype of that energy. Shango represents the archetype of the storm energy. You see what I'm saying? Ogun war energy. Uh, Baron Sunday, the death energy. You see what I'm saying? Oshun, love energy. You know? What up, man? Yeah, yeah. So, so that, that's what it's about. You know? <laughs> so, so, so that's what it's all about. You see what I'm saying? So, let's see here. All right. All right. Let's see. Yeah, but as far as becoming the Jedi Master, you usually gonna train until you become you achieve that master stance in the force. Um, as I've learned in my journeys, you what I would like to say, you acquire it is the force that oversees your trials, lessons, and rituals. You see what I'm saying? It's the force that trains you, I guess we you said. Because remember, the force, the creator, all that are just guiding intelligence that helps you on your path so that you can get what you need to be. <clears throat> so you can get what you need where you need to be in your journey. You see what I'm saying? So 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 um you 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 had these trials and tribulations, you had these lessons and you go through these rituals. To to to, to uh, gr uh, help you grow spiritually, mentally, physically, and so forth. You see what I'm saying? 
So so you go through all this you know, on your journey to become the master, like Bruce Leroy. He became he went on his journey to become the master so he can achieve the gloat. You see what I'm saying? Master Yoda. He he went on his journey. Eight hundred years he held it down. You see what I'm saying? He he held it down as the master because he, the grand master actually that's how powerful he was. He did it so long he became the grand master. He was the most powerful force user in the in the galaxy. You see what I'm saying? So 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 this is what we dealing with. This is what we dealing with. Now now. Now, how do you know you're dealing with a master? I guess, yeah, yeah, yeah. How do you know you're dealing with the master? You know you're dealing with the master because when you see that the master has this holistic, uh, this holistic intelligence or wisdom about him or her. You see what I'm saying? That's how you know you're dealing with the master. You see what I'm saying? It's like they got this intelligence about them. It's like, hmm. Huh. There's something, something special about this person. You can you can feel it from them. And when they speak, they had this, they had this like um this 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 timeless wisdom that you've never heard before from most people. And this this wisdom, this holistic intelligence is represented by a teaching that if you want to become all, you have to practice all. You see what I'm saying? If you want to become all, you have to practice all. So, 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 that's how, that's what the ancient Egyptians were saying when they was, when they was like, um, uh, the, the creator is represented by the all. They called it the all. Cause, and they, and they train every day and learn every day to become more like the all. Become one with the all. You see what I'm saying? That's what it was all about. That's what the, that's what the lessons they was, uh, that, uh, that were being transmitted was all about. Um next what happened is these 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 beings would go on to 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 um ascend into the all energy, the primordial energy. You see what I'm saying? And take what they learned from ancient Egypt with them. You see that like I said, your subconscious mind is archive something. Now now um when we when, when we said the force, when we said the shepherd, this is what we're talking about. The 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 guy, the 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 one who has went through it all, the, the the completed man and woman, the completed God and goddess who has who has went through all the trials and tribulations. Master there's many because remember this is a lifelong journey, it never ends. Master there's many lessons and 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 trials and rituals as they possibly could on their lifelong journey. You see what I'm saying? They grew they they, they grew to become masters. They sold gleam now. You know, they sold glow. They sold emits of force or power or energy or wavelength like no other in this world. You see what I'm saying? Or the next or the galaxy. Whoever this realm. You can go anywhere in the cosmos, in the multiverse, and people will pick up on it like damn. This guy got him. We can feel it. He a master of his art. He a master of his trade. And uh what I learned a long time ago, the reason why you gotta go through this is um uh, in the in the shepherd gonna teach you that gonna teach a student that it that yeah you you true enough you you in training to become your own master and I'm gonna teach you the main techniques. I'm gonna teach you the basic techniques, but it's up to you to fuse those techniques with other aspects of life. Cause, like Palpatine told you in Star Wars, in order to understand the great mystery, you gotta you gotta, you gotta practice all these aspects, the other aspects. You see what I'm saying? That's what that's what it was about. Um, um, so 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 like in the movie Five Deadly Venoms, the the master told him, "Hey, hey." You got all the techniques, you got all the main techniques, but you still got to fuse it together. You see what I'm saying? With, with other arts. So that you can unleash your special kung fu inside of you and upgrade to a five film. The centipede, the scorpion, the snake, you know, the lizard, and the toad. So you can upgrade to that master level stance. That's what he was basically telling. He gave him 
the the game basically to become whatever to to become the new master on the block. So 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 that's what it was about. So 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 this this is what this Baphomet energy is about. This shepherd energy is about guiding you to where you need to be. Um, the shepherd also is about lineage as well. That's why when we talk about the shepherd, you not too far away you see the blood of the lamb. You know the blood the 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 the, the, the blood uh, the or the blood of the Baphomet. You see what I'm saying? Or what they mean by that is inside you inside your genetics you already have a natural dna code that lets you tune in to the creator you know my star seeds know all about this twin flames you know y'all already came with this y'all know y'all had this code inside y'all alone y'all just had to remember y'all came with this information this genetic this genetic material to help uh, um awaken and elevate the planet you know what i'm saying so 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 that's what the blood of the lamb means it's in your genetics. Yeah, did this Jedi force flow through you and in you and around you? You know, you already got it, player. But it's up to you to 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 take it to the next level. It's up to you to be the master and that I never could be. You see what I'm saying? Cause I mastered what I could for what I had, but um um it's up to you to take it to the next level. That's why the apprentice is always usually better than the master. As long as they do what they're supposed to be doing. You see what I'm saying? Because they have a better foundation. And any master will tell you, just like Yoda told Luke Skywalker in The Last Jedi, uh, uh, the student is only as powerful as the mistakes that the master made. You see what I'm saying? You, uh, you, let, them, you let them know your mistakes and your trials and tribulations. So they can pick up on it like, oh, okay. So you did it. So now I know not to do that when I when I come across that trial. You see what I'm saying? So they already got the. It's like in the guideline for a test. They they give you the they give you they give you the questions and answers so you can pass the test. That that that's what it's like when when the master tell you his mistakes and his trials or her her her, her rituals and her uh, experiments that she <clears throat> undertook to get to this point. You see what I'm saying? So this this is this is what this, this 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 is what they mean by the blood of the lamb, the genetics, the lineage. When we say lineage, we just mean um we we just mean different people and processes that are designed to build up generational force, force energy, soul energy, and magical energies up in your DNA. That's all we mean. You 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 more in tune with the creator because your predecessors was in tune with the creator. And they 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 pass that down to their descendants, and now you're the culmination of everything that uh the the that that the, they went through. You got it all inside of you now. That you have way more potential, um, force power, soul power than than uh, than they ever had. You see what I'm saying? You you have way more potential and force power than they ever had. See, 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 see what I'm saying? That, that, that's what it's all about. So, 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 so now when you awaken it fully, you're gonna be way more powerful, way more wiser, way more gifted than your predecessors ever was. You see what I'm saying? They, they may have the experience, but, but, but it's the only thing they got over you. Shoot, shoot. They're, they're not stronger, stronger than you. They just wiser than you because they already went through the trials and tribulations. Now you gotta go through the trials and tribulation. You gotta prove to the force that you got it. And when you prove to the force that you that that, that you got it, that you give it, you'll be touched by it, protected by it for life. You see what I'm saying? No matter what you go through, everything will always seem to work out for you. Like even even and even as time goes on, you're gonna develop that inner knowing, that inner intuition. Like no matter what I go through, no matter what happens, at the end of the day. I'm gonna come out on top. I'm gonna I'm 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 come out. I'm gonna come out unscathed, like a warrior who just fought a huge battle. Everybody else died on the field, but he came out good, unscathed. Damn near, you know, a few rags, a few, few clothes torn or whatever, you know, a few few a few um you know, um armor broke up, sword probably broke, but he good for the most part. You see what I'm saying? So that that's what we mean by protection. 
their, 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 their protection from the creator that divine destiny that the creator has for you so that you can further um, advance the universe multiverse so that you can um, make um, leave your mark on the force and in the force you see what I'm saying that's what it's all about now now when I say lineage um, you know I want I want to also get into this uh, in the Emerald Tablets of Thoth Thoth spoke of the children of the light and the children of the darkness now we, we've learned in our reality who these children of the darkness are the children of the darkness are known as the Cabal Illuminati, dark ET presence, dark entities. That's all working together to keep us down. The children of the light we now know are the star seeds, twin flames, the 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 the, the uh empaths, the the um the the Jedi necromancers, the psychics, you know, everybody who came here to hit to help heal and elevate the planet. See what I'm saying? I right, good. All right, good. Yeah, yeah. Everybody who came here to help heal the planet. You see what I'm saying? That that's what that's what the the order the order of light is. The 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 order of uh ascension. You see what I'm saying? We we, we pretty much just 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 um just beings who came here to to make sure that the planet gets to where she needs to be. We we were tasked with this with this with this operation. This is an operation, a mystical operation, like they showed you in Doctor, Doctor Strange. Remember when Doctor Strange found out uh, that, that that the whole group, the whole clan, was in the uh, middle of a mystical war? Remember that? Yeah, yeah. That that's basically what we dealing with. We re he remembered where he was now. Like, oh, I'm in the middle of a mystical war. Oh shit! <laughs> Y'all gotta tell me how I how we gonna deal with this shit here. How we how we gonna be victorious against these these dark beings these these chaotic ruthless beings you see what I'm saying these cabal this cabal fifth you see what I'm saying so 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 that's that's what it was about so 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 they 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 left the imagery you know the the some of it they was like oh you got fake images that the cabal is using to deceive you and then you got uh, true images that says that's gonna show you the way like say for example I found this image online you know uh, some time ago hope y'all can see it now um, they got a picture of a being here and they got the Baphomet on their shoulder which just basically mean when you see the Baphomet on a person's shoulder they touched by the creator that's all that means but they touched by the creator but they said this picture here is fake because he rocking a sheep and we all know the sheep represents the sheep and we call it in society today the sheep represents the dead the the, the sleeping gods the zombies so he rocking a false image uh this is not the creative this is the image of the sleeping god the the zombified beings you see what i'm saying whereas over here this is this is the image of the the creator the the uh showing you the way pointing the way the shepherd you see what i'm saying the guy the one who shows you um uh how it's gonna be done uh they they also one teaching in the bible that said behold for i uh what is it but behold sheep for i send you out of mr wolves you see what i'm saying so that you be so that you may become wise as serpent serpents and innocent as doves. Now we know that they changed it from lions to sheep. See the land with their certain technologies at the time. That, that's all a lie. That's all a lie. We know what the sheep is. So you're gonna see you an unconscious zombie have to fight wolves. At least the lion was a fierce creature to fight fierce creature. You see what I'm saying? At least it stood a chance against the wolves. The sheep don't stand a chance against it's no that whole book about a called the boy who cried wolf. You see what I'm saying? That, that don't even make sense. But the 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 
I'm gonna change that. It's supposed to be called for I send goats. Uh, you goats out amidst the uh, amidst the wolves, so that you could be serp so that you could become wise as serpents, Kundalini, and and as innocent as dove. You mean talking about your purity? The more the more advanced you become in this world, the wise you become in this world, the more powerful you become, the more pure you become. And when we say pure, you just wholeheartedly doing it. You see what I'm saying? You just you just have a love for this. You just enjoy it because it's built into you. Yeah, it's a built-in program. Program mechanism. So, 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 yeah. So, 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 yeah. You want to be the goat energy, protected by creator. You know, touched by creator. Where you had a creator always showing you the way. Where you to be. You need to be, you know what I'm the way you need to be. So, so I found that little image on on Facebook, and I was like, oh, I told the people this. I gotta show them. I gotta show them the difference between a false image or a cabal image versus a true and living image. You see, you see the Jedi. Like I said, the 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 Jedi has the Creator on his on his uh, been touched by the Creator. Uh, so the Creator got his back. Whereas, whereas uh, this is this is Jesus here. But it don't matter who it is. Jesus, Allah, don't matter. If they rocking a the false energy, they they rocking a the false energy, and they 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 projecting a the false image. You know what are images? Images are um uh what are the basis for your imagination? You see what I'm saying? So if this is what you imagining in your mind, then you are erecting a false image in your uh, mind's eye, and you worshiping what they call in the Bible false idols. You see what I'm saying? Because this is the energy you worshiping instead of worshiping the Jedi here. The, 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 yeah, the, the, the Jedi here, who 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 took up the torch, who took up the torch and went through the process to be in tune with the true Creator. You see what I'm saying? The Baphomet energy. You see what I'm saying? The Creator energy. So 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 that's that's the difference between you know false 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 lies and true and and and, and, and true work. You see what I'm saying? That's that's what we that's what we dealing with. So so never forget that. Never forget. To be in tune with this creator energy, this creator force. Don't don't let them lie to you about you know. Uh, don't let them feed you false images about the creator. You know, you know. Always always stick to your path, and don't ever let no nobody detour you. Um, if you want two movies that show you that, check out the man with the iron fist. In that movie, there he fell off his path. And he suffered for it. He lost his arms for that shit, you know. Y'all yeah, yeah, probably seen the movie. But then we're going to take Jungle and Chain. He stayed on the path. And at the end of the day, he won out. You see what I'm saying? It, 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 uh, he got his woman back. And he got to live happily ever after. See, that's the difference. That They're showing you um, how you are protected. Because they tried to kill Jungle in the movie. But he was protected by, by the creator. You see what I'm saying? But... As far as um, the uh, Rizzle, who, who I forget his name, in the, uh, his name in the, uh, the 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 man with the Iron Fist movie, he, he fell off, you know, and he paid for it, he suffered for it. He wasn't he wasn't that strong as he was supposed to be when that event happened. You see what I'm saying? When when when, when shit went down, he had ignored his path so long that hell, he he forgot how to tap into his force, his power. You see what I'm saying? His energy. Is that that supernatural energy that lives inside of us? That supernatural, the chi is the Asians also call it. So, yeah, that's the main thing. But with that being said, that's that's the major part of this lecture. Y'all got any questions? Put your questions up now.
I answer a few before I get up out of here. <clears throat> Well, if y'all don't have nothing, and I'm about to, what's up, Davis Toast? I'm about to get off now, sadly. But, um, y'all, since I, y'all don't have any questions, I'm about to get up out of here. Marvin Jones, share this with your friends, put the word out, and I'm out. Peace.